Ron. I'm kidding. What the f Get the f up, man. I made your lunch. You missed warm up. I don't know what you're doing. What time is it? Did I get my six or nine hours in? Oh. A little bit warm in here. I might pick you up. Now we're ready. The fucker's moved in. He's actually moved in. He's a pig. He doesn't clean up. Beer cans everywhere. Doesn't pitch in. Doesn't give any money. He's useless. Absolutely useless. Mm, nature's nectar. How much longer we got, man? Dude, Ron, a little less than 10 minutes. Calm down. Six or nine minutes. You know what that means, it's time to get pumped up. Enough with this pussy stuff you play on the radio. Let me get my playlist out. Woo, buddy! Yeah! Now that's the shit right there, son. I cannot listen to this anymore. We've heard it six or nine times. The Star Spangled Banner. It's been an hour. It's what dreams it's are made drive. of. Six or nine times we've listened to this already. I'm a f***ing patriot. I know what the Star Spangled Banner is. Listen, if you watch any major sporting event, whether it's the football or the basketball go, or the Ron, baseball. Ron Logic, let's hear it. Come on, go ahead. They it play that shit before every major sporting event to get the athletes ready. So if we're athletes and we're trying to get ready, we need to be listening to Star Spangled Banner. Well, if I ain't pumped up this Monday after this song, this is the last time, you're done. So All right, well, it's, it'll work. Trust me. Your lap times are going to be six or nine seconds quicker than they've ever been. <gasps> Ron. <gasps> Ron, what the f*** are you doing? Stop drawing dicks on my <laughs> window. <laughs> Look. Look. We have five minutes left. Just sit there, put your hands in your lap. Don't f***ing touch nothing. Well, fine, I won't f***ing help anymore then. Dick. All right, we're at the club, man. Hell yeah. What's what's the girl to guy ratio, man? At least it has to be 69% girls, or I say, well, let's back. What, you got Nicoletti, son? Jesus, Brayden? Ron. Where's the Ronnie sign should be next, right? Ron, you're thinking about the wrong f***ing club, man. It's a Monday, it's not a Friday or Saturday. <sighs> Well, there's still going to be girls here, though, right? <laughs> you got some bad, bad news for you. But <laughs> some bad news? Bad news. Ain't no chicks within a 20-mile radius of this club. You know what's great? I've been uh, buddies with Phil for a little while now. Been watching him closely probably the last six or nine years, watching his craft on the racetrack. This year, obviously, got number 69, so I feel like we got a little bit more of a connection. There's a little vibe going on between us, but watching him the last, you know, six or nine years, like I said, I'd say that the big thing is these young kids, they need mentors. They need someone to look up to, someone to show them the ropes, how to live, how to live like a champion, you know. So me being in his house, uh, us eating all the meals together, um, Every now and then, you know, we do the dishes together. I do the washing, he does the drying. And, um, you know, just having that bond, that Team 69 bond, I feel like this is going to be Phillip's year, you know. He's going to have himself a, a season, season to remember. Dude's a f***ing degenerate.